Hello gorgeous and welcome to day 6 of Invisible Ink with me Matt Lees. I am the best. I am the best. This time it's just me because Quinn's is busy and that's reasonable. He's going to come back for the finale but in the meantime I think I'm going to go it alone and hope, hope beyond hope that I don't somehow completely fluff it up while he's not here. But that could happen. Who knows? Monster's trying to sell me stuff but I don't want it. It's a gun. Anyway. I've done a bit of juggling stuff here. So we've got Buster Chip on Internationale. We've got uh, some stuff going around. We've got a second cloaking rig, do you remember? And that's now on Rush. Rush has got some modified legs with gel injectors, so she starts with more speed, but then loses it as you go on, making her the opposite of Decca. But we'll see how we get on with that. Everybody is pretty hunky, hunky, hunky. But uh, yeah, I'm going to jump into a mission. I've got a vault key. And so I'm going to go to a vault because... Because why not? Corporations have trillions in credits. This is going to be interesting because, frankly, although Quinn's was beside me, hoping I would fail, I think everybody knows that whilst occasionally, admittedly, he did give me information which wasn't that helpful, um, not on purpose, uh, apparently. At the same time, these corporate pigs make me sick, I know what you mean. Um, I do feel like he helped me out on numerous occasions. There were many, many times where I would have been absolutely shafted if not for him mentioning something to me. So we're going to see how I get on with this stuff. And I've got messages on Facebook, I think. Probably little doo-doo noises in the video. Sorry about that. 13 AP. What a lot. Look at this. We've infiltrated a power relay station. This could be helpful if we have some extra power to sell. The station only manages large exchanges, though. Find the relay switches. Protocol says there should be two, and they need to be activated at the same time. That'll open the door. Fascinating. So I can actually sell power here. That is genuinely quite fascinating. That's got a five bonus. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. What's going on with this guard? He recaptures stuff, and if KO'd, he'll possess something as a demon program. That is annoying. All right. Just to enter and think there's anything I can do about this. Oh boy. And it doesn't seem like that guy's moving, so I don't think I can do anything about that. Hmm. Right, let's get busy with hacking. Okay. some stuff on there and then I'm gonna try and push through here so this guy's gonna spot me now unless unless I use a dart armor piercing one knocks out a guard for three turns you know I might just do that oh okay that's that's not what I wanted to do however Ooh, blocked. Why is it blocked? Modded Mark 1. What's... What's the modded Mark 1? What does that mean? Modded Mark 1. Oh no, that's the name of the guy. He's blocked by stuff. Well, this isn't ideal. This guy's going to get shot if he moves, isn't he? That's the way it works. Man, I don't want to spend a rewind this early, but I'm not sure I've got any other choice. Unless I use my cloaking rig. Yeah, might as well. Might as well. Let's press on. I'm 
before I leave here, let's get some power. So this guy's going to walk around there, and then he's going to get bashed in the back of the head. Let's get this guy out of sight. Mmm. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Let's get you out of the way. <laughs> um. Gosh, what a lot of people. And this guy doesn't have a weapon, I just remembered. He does, however, have a shock trap. <sighs> but that's the thing. Flashback. And I can detonate that, yes. Okay, cool. How is that blocked? Can she not shoot around the corner? Guard. Okay, let's just detonate that. That has added a demon to that switch, but to be honest, I'm not too sure about the whole selling power thing anyway. I kind of need power. This is the point where I'm going to have to take a bit of a risk now, though, because... I can't... So he's going to... Yeah, okay, now I can shoot him with a gun. Bit sloppy, but... Not too bad. Okay, that's good. Let's get one of them on. Let's get a little thing on that. Don't know what it's going to do, but hey, let's let's start fixing things. All right. Okay. Fine. 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 So, stealing, of course, the most important of all of the uh, the types of things that you can do in the world. If anyone else starts coming down here, there's going to be some trouble. But I'm hoping that we can just sort of leave all of the bodies clumped together in one tight little little bundle of fun. <laughs> What's the worst that can happen in this situation? I don't know. Okay. Paralyze a dose on that guy. Steal some stuff from him. Excellent. And then pin you. See, I've got a system. I've got a system, right? Pin, pin. And they will be pinned, but I can't do it just yet. And I've not been closing any doors. Which is uh, un un undoubtedly going to be pissing off a great deal of you. But hey, that's that's kind of... Uh, comes with the territory, unfortunately. Um, you guys know that that's the way it is. What's going on with that? Is that... Okay, so I think that, that just opens that door here. Let's see what we've got. Okay, fine. Let's unlock that. Move in there. And then peek. Ace. This is, uh, again, going uncharacteristically well for me. Let's spend stuff while I've got it. Sweet! Extra... <laughs> okay. That's... That's a bit of an issue, isn't it? <laughs> Look at this. I'm worried that he might come out of here and somehow notice a tremendous quantity of... Uh, of, of guards. <laughs> um... Hmm... I'm going to send her into the vault, I think. These two into the vault, if possible, and then send the other two to try and uh, find the exit. I don't know how this is going to work. Has he got any armor? No, he's not got any armor. So to be honest, this isn't too bad. I might just... Hang on, if I put them both... here and here, then... 
He can't get out. No, it also means if I set him to ambush, then that should work because he's not got any armor. That's going to switch back on again. That's going to get hacked. Relay switch can jog on. Not interested. Hmm. Should I start investigating over here, though? I probably should. Okay. I think you'll have noticed in this series is I really struggle when to know when to use the dagger for one power just because it's like it's so cheap and it has the five turn cooldown but obviously if I use it early then it's it's good because it means you know I'll get it it'll come off cooldown but I always seem to just use it flippantly and then desperately need it the next turn so I'm trying to be a bit more sensible about it this time okay doesn't look like there's anything going on here so let's just wait it out here. They're just advancing the alarm tracker jobbies. Although it does seem a waste to just... They've got all these XAP. Maybe I should just push on. Yeah, I think I should, you know. I think I should just forget about the whole ambush situation and just push on. However, that is going to switch back on in a minute, so... No. Let's just... All right. Hang on a minute. Seven. Oh, it's a shame it cost me a point to go down there because I could almost just run in, look through the door and then run back. What I am going to do is just shut this door though. And then switch ambush back on. Okay. This is starting to remind me of, um... Okay, so the guards are patrolling more places, which is not great, but at the same time actually not that bad, because a lot of the guards, you'll notice, are just asleep, which is cool. So we got, that guy's waking up in one, that guy's waking up in three, two question is do we stay here or do we go I reckon we just press on what's that for is that secondary server terminal I have no idea what that does really well screw it let's start behaving in a very erratic way what that does secondary server terminal what does it do just operate it I mean maybe it's just something I need to do I've just got to found it find a power relay and get out in one play one piece all right I've actually remembered to bring the right guy here Decker has got the key to the vault So much money again, just so much money. They'll change their codes after this. That one's useless to us now. <sighs> Big treasure. Oh, it's just a shop, isn't it? I forgot about that. This is the sort of thing that if Quids was here, remind me of, because I'm just really stupid. That's interesting. Break one firewall for three power. And what's this? Hmm, expensive stuff. I do not need. Fine. Next time I'll remember what these things are. 
No, I'm not going to use the dagger, because I know what will happen. Where is this flipping thing? Let's actually try and get vision on these people. I wonder if, yeah, because I reckon I, these guards are all in my vision, technically, so I wonder what happens if I use my tag. Yeah, it tags them all! That's wicked. Um, means when they wake up, I'll know where they're going. That is just ridiculous. And I love it. Let's get a bit cocky here and just start using stuff. Okay, so there's a chance it could be down there, or it could be down here. We've got the, this guard is going to investigate here. Okay, fine. I think it's time to get a move on. Especially because, oh my gosh, she has 17 AP. And that's even without burst. I could... I could burst this. <laughs> Look at that, she can get all the way over here. And that's without sprinting either. My gosh, with sprinting, I, I don't even know. I could have, although I can't, yeah, wow. Let's invest, okay, brilliant. I'm really glad I did that, because I almost was just gonna be like, well, I'll, you know, I'll go and look at there in a minute. I'll go and look in a minute, but as it turns out, Fine. Everything's absolutely fine. Now... This is the point where I wonder, do I, uh... Do I rinse the place or not? <laughs> do I rinse or do I go? Oh, no, I can't. I've got to find the power thing. Of course. Hmm... Okay. Let's try going here. Oh, I should have shut that door. I'm such an idiot. It's genuinely a bit embarrassing how uh, how consistently bad I can be at this sometimes. Um, let's throw the transport beacon down somewhere. I should have given the transport beacon to somebody else. All right, weird change of plans. Just go for the double door. Doubling down on doors.com. Okay, everyone's gonna wake up. That's the thing, everyone's gonna wake up, but... I Well, that actually, that could have, okay. <laughs> <laughs> that could have been bad if I had stuck with my initial original plan there. <laughs> okay. Okay. So let's get that. Secure case. Experimental research. Deposit boxes. Funsies. Is that not okay, that's through that door. I can't tell now if I'm playing if I'm playing better than I would be uh, normally or not. I guess on the one hand I'm less distracted, but on the other hand I haven't got any help. Hmm. Swings and roundabouts. Let's go shopping. Oh, <gasps> that looks good. That is expensive, power-wise, though, like, look at that. Armor-piercing three, fantastic, but costs two power per point of armor. So that's basically cost six to use, but three, three, expensive stuff as well. That's pretty strong as well. Generates two power per one turn when deployed. Oh gosh. Let's 
let's buy one of them. And I think I might buy this as well. Portable Server 3. Because, you know, you just got to treat yourself, haven't you, really? You really do just have to treat yourself. Where is this flipping... That's grid B3, is that that? Yes, it is. Okay, so I don't need to switch that off. But I could do with switching some of these things off. Hmm. Interesting. Let's whack that on there. Not sure that's a terribly good idea either. I can, oh no, I can't even remotely hack that because that's what she does. Nobody else can do that. I keep forgetting that that's not a thing that like anybody can do. Okay. Let's get, let's get her in place. Chappy chap, where are you gonna go? What are you gonna do? Chappy chap. Oh, hang on. Uh oh. Forgot he's potentially going down there as well, leaving her in less of a good position. That should be fine. Let's leave it like that. Getting this guy around though, I've got to get him on the move because if he just stays there, we're going to have some real trouble. And these guys are all going to start waking up pretty damn soon. That's red, so you can't do that. Could throw that. You can actually throw it quite far, can't you? You know, I might just do that. That's pretty cool. That's a pretty cool move, I think. Okay, cool. Because I'm thinking he can always go, whoa, and then just run around the corner. I mean, that's now not an ideal position at all, but... This could be worse. This could... Could be worse. Everything's rebooting because now that guard's awake. He's switching on the security again. Not great. Um, and... Yeah. Okay. Let's have fun. Shock trap at the door. Hmm. Let's use the fun thing. Burst. No, I was going to say you could. Actually, I think I could. No, it must be blocked, surely. That would be ridiculous just to be like. Da, 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 da. He can, however, do that, which is pretty nice. And then, actually, I think going there is... No, he gets seen there. Okay. She, however, has got so much now. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. I mean, it's not that bad either, but it's not good. Okay, that's excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Let's just get this done. Knife it. Oh no! Oh, it's alright, only cost one. So I save one, but... I gotta keep more of an eye on what demons actually do. Okay. When in Rome, be really greedy. That's, that is my... That is my phrase about Rome. 
what I would do for the ability to just walk through walls temporarily now. That would be pretty sweet. Gonna see what happens. I'm feeling good about this. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling confident. I'm usually running on a very strong caffeine buzz at this point in the day, but right now I'm fine. I've had one coffee, one cup of tea. I'm good. I'm pretty zen. Okay, that's the burst. That's the other end of the burst though, isn't it? So that's a that's a pickle, a fine old pickle I'm in. Okay, you should be fine there. You pretty much can't move unless you knock a guy out, which you could do. Again, can't really do anything unless you're going to knock a guy out. Knocking people out might actually be a cool thing to do at this point. Yeah, let's just knock people. Oh, I can't. Not enough power. Well. <laughs> well, uh. Yeah, I sure have left myself without options here, haven't I? Um. Yeah, because I could move there, but that's not going to work until. Huh. No, okay, I could. Maybe do this. That's going to bump up the security. Oh, no, it's not enough power again because it's... Oh, you idiot. Why would you do that? And that's still people coming to investigate, isn't it? Okay, fine. Where? Where are they investigating? No more ammo in that, so that's a thing. And actually, if he walks back. Oh, he's going that way. And he's going to just spot Decker. Decker's got two turn cooldown on his cloaking rig. Mm, this is not ideal. Let's snick some stuff while we're here. Um. All right. That's going to work. That's actually pretty smart. I'm happy with that. Oh, I could use my EMP pack, couldn't I? Okay. I might as well. See if I can snag that safe on the way out. So I'm thinking what's going to happen here is that this guard is going to turn around to walk over there. He's going to spot uh, International rather than Decker. And International still has her Cloaking Rig 3. Because now they have two Cloaking Rig 3s and uh, one low-level Cloaking Rig. It might mean more people running in. I am concerned about that. I've been particularly bad. And that's a problem. I think she's the one person who doesn't have <laughs> Cloaking. So that actually might be a really big problem. She has got one of them and but it's armored. However, ventricular lance. Will ventricular lance Oh no, it's not gonna work because she only gets bonus one. No, she's got a modder cloaking rig. It's fine. It's genuinely fine. Genuinely a bit silly at this point in uh, the playthrough, I've got to be honest. Genuinely a bit silly. And this is one time when I really do want to remember to shut the door. Okay, that's nice. Well. Well out of the way. Well gone. And now I think it's time for everybody just to get legging it now. Get legging it. Hmm. 
They don't have a clue. I am invisible. I'm putting the invisible into invisible ink quite frequently here. Let's be honest. Unlock power station using relay switches. No, don't need to do that. Get out alive. Did I need to do that thing? I don't know. How can I tell if I've done it? I think I've done it. Escape with the power cell. I did the power cell. I did the vault. Yeah. I think I think I did it. Let's find out. Yeah. Excellent work, operator. Now we have to find a way to spend our newfound fortune. Yeah, fantastic. I've just got to leave with my small fortune. Some of which I've already spent on things, toys on the fly. Gosh. I don't need anybody. I am the best in an independent fashion. This is ridiculous. This is just unbelievably overpowered. Net worth of 53k. Credits, only got 1,633 to spend, but that's because, frankly, I did quite a lot of shopping on the fly. Yeah, gosh, 2,900. And now everybody's just ridiculously kitted up. Everything's just good. Everything's fine. It's, um, it's frankly just getting a bit silly at this point. Bring on the finale, whenever that may be. I think I've set a few missions off it. Good lord. Anyway, thank you for watching. Goodbye. Thanks again for watching. Hopefully it's been all right this week with just me and not Quinn's babbling to myself. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, but he's a busy man. And it was frankly getting a bit boring for him just sitting watching me be good at it with him effectively just talking about the clangers. If you are enjoying this video, so you can go to coolghost.net and let us know what you think of them. There'll actually be a description link in this, which will take you directly to the exact page you need to talk about this episode. And if you've really, really enjoyed this series, you might consider supporting us on Patreon. It's patreon.com forward slash Cool ghosts. Thanks very much. Goodbye.